My name is Paul King and I'm giving important information about Russian KGB agents that are directly tied to Vladimir Putin, their classmates of his, and they came here in the late 1980s strictly and simply to destroy the American system. Why? Because they were mad about the Cold War and they wanted to show Americans that their system doesn't work, that they're not that smart, and that Russians are uh, superior. Um, Lev and Sofia Boyanovsky are their names. On Interpol, they're known as Igor and Galina Sideronsky. And on the FBI's most wanted list, they're Victor and Natalia Wolf. They've had FBI agents in South Florida and police officers in Sunny Isles Beach help them cover up all the fraud. They helped Donald Trump build six high-rise buildings in Sunny Isles. And that's how they laundered hundreds of millions of dollars into America and corrupted judges, lawyers, politicians, and so on. Sophia took a job at Staten Island Technical High School in order to teach Russians how to break into corporations, get legitimate jobs at corporations, and, and then use it to break the system, to hack in and to get information, eyes and ears, on every major uh, company that America has. They have people inside. How do I know all this? Because they kidnapped me as a young child. They also kidnapped my younger brother, Daniel Boyanovsky. And I was able to get close enough to finally put all the pieces together. A DNA test will prove this. Today, Sophia and Lev live in a $15 million West Hollywood house. Shouldn't we find out how they got that money? In October 2001, a month after 9-11, the FBI raided Lev and Sophia. They had them. But they bribed FBI agent Scott Owens, and they were able to, um, they were able to cover it up, get away with it. <coughs> I'm putting all this information out there because, oh, also Michael Blanowski, their oldest son, their actual biological son, kidnapped his oldest son, Mark. A DNA test will prove this. There's plenty of information and evidence uh, to go around. You can look at South Florida lawsuits filed against these people. Um, there's evidence everywhere. Once we take them down and their network of thousands of Russians across the country, we can start building America back.